Forward now, just cutting live to Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sriharikota, where ISRO is launching its PSLV rocket carrying EOS N1 or Anvesha and 15 other satellites belong, belonging to India, Europe, Brazil to outer space. One, zero. S139 motor and uh, both strap ons ignite. Here's the pillar of Lift fire, meets the T1 canvas tracking. of blue. PSLV is C62 flying the umbilical tower, a majestic lift off. PSLVC 62 promotion yaan ka safalta poorn uthapan pratham promotion manch se aur bad chala hai apne udish kaksha ki aur is mission ko poora karne ke liye EOS Alright, this is a mission that will be marking this is marking the 64th flight of PSLV which is India's most reliable and successful launch vehicle Now the mission is being carried out by the new space India Limited and it represents the ninth dedicated commercial mission to build and launch an Earth observation satellite now, of course, this has been developed by Defense Research and Development Organization, DRDO. The Anvesha satellite is designed to provide cutting-edge imaging capabilities. Now, what that means is that it enables India to map enemy positions with pinpoint accuracy. Now, beyond this strategic payload, this mission is historic for another reason. And it's so interesting that India's private space sector is stepping into the limelight. For the first time, a single Indian private company, Dhruva Space, Dhruva Space based in Hyderabad, is contributing seven satellites to this mission. This is in the Indian Space Research Organization has launched this PSLV C-62 EOS N1 mission. And this is marking the 64th flight of the PSLV, which is India's most reliable and successful launch vehicle. And prevent them station beginning to Along with the primary data. payload, the EOS N1 or the Anvesha the satellite, the rocket will also deploy 15 co passenger satellites from both Indian and international customers. As mentioned before, it is launching its PSLV rocket carrying EOS N1 or Anvesha and 15 other satellites belonging to India, Europe, Brazil to the outer space. And these are live visuals the coming in from Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sri Harikota in India's Andhra Pradesh. Current altitude is 93 kilometers. Dithiya Charan, Vikas Engine ka prayog karte huye, tatha indhan ke roop mein US 25.